Was there anyone that you hadn't spoken to for a while or that you were particularly pleased to see there? When you don't remember things, it's, it's terrible. to Wembley and I watched them and I'm, I can't remember that. I can remember playing, I can't remember taking you. <laughs> Kenny, you're back where it all started, back at Selhurst yeah. Park, back at Crystal Palace. How does it feel? Feels great. It's great, you know, seeing pictures of Mark and Allison. It's great, really, because he was the manager at the time. I had some great managers and some great people, and they looked after me. And that was my life, football. And you described this, this period as the best time of your life. 1975, you made your debut. You're back here now, 2023. How do you reflect on, on the journey that you've been on since? Oh, it's fantastic. My mum made me a footballer. She, she really made me. You know, I played for England schoolboys, England youth. You know, it was such an upbringing for me. I don't, I, I don't really remember it all mm. exactly. I remember, you know, playing at Wembley and waving to me where my mum sat, and um, I remember that. And I just had a little wave, a little wave. Uh, <laughs> It was brilliant. Because when you walk out of Wembley, mm. it gives you something. It's just, it's amazing. Can you describe the feeling? God, dear me. <laughs> it just goes, you just, your heart goes bigger. Yeah. You, you, you just feel, I'm only five or six, but it's <laughs> only about six. So you, do, you, you, you just feel you're the one. And is there one England game that you think of most? I think the one I've scored in, I scored with my right foot, I think. I can't remember. And that didn't happen very often, <laughs> did it? <laughs> no, I didn't score many goals. <laughs> That's one thing people would say to me, how many goals you scored? I said, not many. <laughs> you know, I, mean, I, I played 86 times for England. I should have played more. If I didn't have drink, I would have played a lot more. And I think drink, ruined my life. It did. That's one thing I can say for sure. And I know that now. I just, I physically know it. All I remember is drinking. I'd always bring a bottle of wine home. Always. Drinking was horrendous. The more I drank, the more I liked it. And I, I drank even more. You know, you're talking about, if I was seeing him at a bar, I'd, I'd drink six bottles of wine. It's bloody crazy. Almost killed my mum. I think my drinking was a uh, terrible state, and uh, I'm sure that other people will give up if they watch this. Or... Is that is that your hope now to to help inspire other people? Oh yeah, inspire your people. Yeah, I'd love to be able to help people who drink. You know, tell them my story as such, but tell them what it does to you. It ruined my football career. It messes people up and it makes you a fool. How do you feel mentally and physically in yourself now? I feel great. I think it's April, it's three to be three years without drinks, so that, that it takes some doing. What was it that you think made the difference in this period from getting you to stop drinking? What, what was the turning point? Drinkers know what they're doing. You know, love, obviously I, I say to myself every now and then, shall I have a glass or do I have a glass? No, no, no. The word is no. 
what was your true character you think what was what would people say about the true Kenny Sampson the Joker well, a lot of them say he's a joker he loves telling a story I do a few impressions Tommy Cooper I do Frank Spencer never mind <laughs> um, you know I do all sorts of impressions really what do you make of the current Arsenal team? Obviously, they're top of the league, doing really well. I think they're doing really well. They're, they're a team. They are Arsenal football team. Mm. Obviously, I, I thought of it last night, funny enough. They should call them the, the Arsenal. That's what they should call them. Mm. That's what they, I'll call them anyway. You know, who, who do you play for? The Arsenal. What are the things that now you can enjoy them? What are the things that you enjoy doing with your kids and your grandchildren and your family? Well, I can enjoy my kids. I can enjoy my grandkids. You know, it's great. I can take them to football matches if they want to go. I can take them wherever they want, when I want. It's up to me. It's what I do now. Yeah. You feel in charge again. Yeah. Yeah. I feel like I'm the dad. You know, I've got, I'm going to be the, the dad. There, Dad. And what, what were you before? I was a drunk. <laughs>